So we have we have a quarter inch at the bottom. What did you say up at the top? That was inch and a quarter. Inch and a quarter. So the coping is falling at a different level, a different uh, s slope. Right. Than is the uh, the, the steps. Uh huh. Now that obviously what is not desirable. It's not desirable, but the thing is, is if if you mess with the level here, yeah, you're going to end up with a different you know, a different slope here, which is going to probably affect the coping too. How, how about the coping up there, Dan? Is that coping have to, if we lower that floor, that, that decking up there uh -huh. three inches, that coping then is, is it's going to be exposed. Yeah. Be exposed. Yep. Is that going to look weird? Uh, yeah. Yeah. So in your, in, in your opinion, it would be, do we, do we just need to replace these, the copings? I, I would say so because the, those two, the, the the last two, have to go anyway, and so I, I actually gave them a price to to tear those two out, you know, a couple of years ago. So they're aware of that. But yeah, these, you know, I would say I would say you could save. This coping, it's in good shape, but we, we're going to have to relay it at whatever that slope is. So pull it off. Exactly. Save it. And, and, and we're going to have to do some brickwork too, you know, to, to get the brick up to wherever it needs to be because this slope should follow the slope of the stairs. That brick, are you just going to demo those out and put new ones in? Yeah, you just tooth it in. That's, that's not a... Tooth it in? Yeah. Before the coping goes on. Mm-hmm. Okay. Because if we lower, if we like, if we lower this, you're going to have brick exposed that you know has been had sealing against it and everything. So we got to tear that out anyway. So, so basically, you know that that drain situation is driving the steps, the coping, and the the slope of that is an that's the steps are driving that. I guess is the best the way. The steps to say are that. driving the. The level of the coping. That's that's correct. And so, so you're we're going to have to reset it anyway, and we're going to have to rework the brick. Rework the brick. Yeah. Okay. So, just in, in your estimation, do you see us needing to again remove this underlying concrete of the steps, or change it, or would it be tear it out and report the step the underlying concrete? Yeah, it would be. You can't really change it. The only thing I can do is I can add to the the mortar joint uh, of the bed but you know I, I can I can't show I can't show that right right here in other words I can't make that a, a one one inch thickness and this a half inch thickness I, that it all needs to be equal so I mean the I, I think I think it's probably going to be if they've got to tear that out they're probably going to have to tear these steps out too then you can put them at whatever level you want, lay it out, and, and just perfect. Get it perfect, yeah. And that's going to help you to maybe work this out where, where you don't have to... But that's the other issue there. It's not an issue up here yeah. be, because you don't have it... Uh, I mean, that's what it is, but it, we've got to get slope out here. And I, I honestly don't know what the slope is. We actually shot this. We had a surveyor shoot all this. Yep. We have the spot elevations. I don't have them with me. That's five and three quarters, and that's four and a quarter. So I, I think you probably got the slope there. Okay. Which is great. You know, that's that's nice to not have to rework this, but up there you just don't you don't have any choice because of those doors. Yeah, the doors. Okay.